Hey guys, welcome back to a new tutorial where we're going to be learning how to build our very own Pokédex Discord bot. Now, to give you a preview of what we're going to build, I'm going to showcase a demo of our final product. Now, <clears throat> if you aren't familiar with Pokémon, this might be a new concept for you, but for, I'm assuming that many of you are, and many of you are familiar with at least Pokemon Go, but essentially Pokedex allows you to search for any Pokemon um, based on its number or generally in the game or in the TV show, you can actually scan a Pokemon and it will be able to reveal that Pokemon. In this case, we don't, we're not gonna um, showcase any image recognition, but we're gonna have a bot that allows us to search Pokemon by a number or a name. And in the video or in the show as well, it also does a playback where it'll play back a description to Ash, the main character, about the Pokemon itself. So let's go ahead and show that demo and what that looks like. Let's just say we're in the text chat here and I'm just gonna say hello and the bot's not gonna respond. But if it recognizes a command that it's familiar with, in this case, we have it set to exclamation mark Pokedex, um, it will actually respond to that uh, request. So let's just say Pokedex and we'll do a number one and that's gonna be the very first Pokemon in the Pokedex. So let's see what happens. Bulbasaur, the poison, Pokemon. Bulbasaur can be seen napping in bright sunlight. There is a seed on its back. By soaking up the sun's rays, the seed grows progressively larger. Great. So if you see here, um, we have a visual uh, feedback or a visual result of what the Pokedex um, result is. And we also have a audio playback or a text um, voice channel, a voice playback, whatever you want to call it, of the description in the format that Pokédex is what we're generally familiar with. So I can showcase one more example and um, let's just do something from a later generation such as um, 524. I have no idea what that's gonna be, but I'm kinda interested. So let's see what happens. Rock and roll up the rock Pokémon. Cool. The hexagonal hole is its ear. Deep in that ear is an energy core. So if you stick your hand in there, rock and roll will be very angry. Yikes, that's a, I've actually never seen that Pokemon. But anyways, this is actually a really cool bot. And in this tutorial, we're gonna show you how to how to design it, how to understand your project requirements, to do some research, as well as um, starting with coding, just the visual piece of it, and then doing the audio aspect, and then how we're gonna deploy it to make it available to your guild or even friends that you might want to use it or who might, who might want to actually play with it. So that's just gonna be our very introduction to this series. Um, we, I already have the, the written tutorials available for part two of the series. So feel free to, if you want to go ahead and get fast and started really quickly, on top, uh, instead of watching the videos, you can go ahead and do that. But I'm really excited for this series and I hope you are too. Let me know what you think and let's get started and let's build something.